Hey every pony, new and leave here, and today we're back for more Fallout Equestria Remains One Life Challenge. And today, um, well, you see, I only have one life, as, as you'll remember. I started this challenge and I got plenty of bits. And I think I also, yes, I hit level 4, and when you hit level 4, I reckon that means you get a new spell. Yes, there we go. And today we have to do some things in the factory. I think we have to beat two or three levels of the factory. I don't know how many of them we'll be able to do this episode, but we will see what we can find. But before we go there, I want to accept as many quests as I can find so we can have a little bit more bits sometimes. Which also, in my previous One Life run of the previous version of this game, played a major role in me being able to afford what I had at the end. All right, yeah. Dialogue, schmialogue. Yes, Miss Winry, did we get all of them? No, we did. Oh, mole rat fat. Oh, that's part of a quest. Let's actually do that. Let's see if we can turn in all the mole rat fat. Let's see. I think there was... Um, hey, what? I'm trying to figure out what sprinting was again, because there was a way to dodge things with sprinting and jumping. This, this weird jump thing, which... I always found to be a very strange mechanic in the game, but it's it's an interesting one all along. We can do like this and dodge. Wait, oh. Oh, that pony down there has socks? Oh. I wonder if they would suit me. Anyway, let's go to... Oh, was that where I'm supposed to go? Okay, telekinetic bullet, magic bullets, ice shards. I'm going to stay with the magical bullets. Um, This way. Ammo, explosives, and some caps. We're gonna try to amass as many caps as we can. Riches is like the one way to make sure that you have a shot at beating this game. Right? Do you have riches? No? Well, that's too bad then, because I was gonna let you live if you had some. Right? Believe it or not, I'm the most um, honest and poker face proof pony ever, and we don't. We're not gonna bother about this. This is probably just some old weapon we're never gonna need. Um, so we're better off saving the lockpicks for saves down the line, and oh boy. I'm not gonna go down there. Pretty sure that's gonna get me for at least 30 to 40 of my health. A submachine gun. So who's in here, though? I remember down here being important. Got ya. And we have our first save. 50% chance, and we have... The access terminal, which is connected to it. This is why I wanted the electronic lockpick. If if I can't, if I somehow manage to not being able to open the safe, I can still get through it with the uh, electronic lockpick. Fifty percent chance. Got it. What do we get? An emerald, a memory orb. I definitely saw that. I definitely saw the toaster repair and the memory orb. Status, skills, magic. So before we fight the first boss, and when that moment comes, um, as it definitely will, we need to have our magic maxed all the way. We need Battle Mage 3 and all the damage that we can get, and then we can take him out with uh, the magical bullet together with some uh, different armor. We're going to need fireproof armor, or better said, fire-resistant armor, and the game provides if we get far enough. So let's be... Careful and gentle when making our way to beating this old boss. Failed to open the lock on a 75% chance. You gotta be kidding me. I don't buy that. Oh, look, looky, there's a little rat in there. Hey, buddy. Got it. I need to have... I need to have that chest. Sometimes you can get gems in here. Oh, wait. I realize I'm out of lock picks or bobby pins, but I got an emerald, which is worth it. Which is very worth it. Oh, wait. You need to press Z two times. All right, our first tougher enemy who can make us bleed and drain health. Wait, that pony down there heard something. You didn't hear anything. Sheesh, what's this mister up to? The raider pervert. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm going to one-up you, buddy. I'm going to one-up you with something that you didn't even think was possible. Right? Let's use the telekinetic bullets and see if I can, um, you know do this properly. Got it. See? I'm pretty sure he didn't see that coming. Anyway, 15% chance on the info terminal and 15 on the axis, but we can get this one. Oh, yes. Very, very good stuff. Wait, um, another memory orb 
and a potion of spirit? Well, all I have to do is just keep giving myself magic. That's all that matters. So when the level up comes, we'll have points that we can put into other areas, which is a nice thing. Uh, magic bullets, wait, what about this guy? 15% chance, can we get him without the lockpick? I think we can, right? Please? Uh, bad luck. Uh, system's blocked, fine. Right, oh wait. Um, I remember that terminal was in order to open over there, wait. Oh, this thing, we can try this. We can try this, every pony. Can we get you? Access terminal. We got it! Alright, that means that the door at the bottom left side is open now. Thanks, 15% chances! Oh, you don't get any 15% chances. You get no chance whatsoever. And, oh, look at, look at this. This little mine's gonna get me if I'm not careful, so... Let's be careful about how we open these things. And go down and then get this one. Ammo box? I'm not doing anything for an ammo box. But if I can open it and get ammo that I can sell, that's actually very helpful. So this is... Oh, oh you gotta be... You gotta be kidding me, I remember this. Um, yeah, there's a chance if I disarm that, that the checkpoint will blow up along with myself. The checkpoint will work though, but I'm gonna be... <laughs> I'm gonna be in pieces. Just like you are right now. Got him. Um, boo. He survived a magical bullet. Your other friends didn't. What makes you so tough then? Sheesh, I wanna have what he has. Um, large magic potion? Perfect. Uh, medicine is fun. I definitely want that. Definitely want that. Let's see, well, how does medicine work again? Each skill point makes potions stronger. That's that's actually kind of good. We should actually have that. 30% chance. Oh, please, I need to get in. Oh, we got it. It was very important to get in here because there is a bookshelf, and bookshelves have magical arts. Is, is that going to make, make my magic stronger? Please. Magic has been improved. Oh, my goodness. Are we going to have another amazing episode like last time? Because we... We got just about everything we could have ever asked for last time around, so... Can we get more? Well, didn't get hit by you. We have to head down, though, but I also want to make sure that I have a couple of bits before we move. So who's in here? Hello, roaches! Get the fans. Boxes. Boxes. And trash cans. Oh, you... You had to be in there, didn't you? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, I remember, there's... There's a, um, a safe up here if we get lucky. There it is. Eyes on the prize. Oh, oh it's mine. Never mind. At least we get this. I'm, I'm definitely staying away from anything that's mine for, like, a long time. Unless I have ways to get around the explosives. Which can happen if you have, like, an access terminal in the same room with a mine safe. You can open the safe if you beat the access terminal. Uh, telekinetic bullet. No, I actually need the magical ones for now. And a way down. Oh, there was a way down to the left side here, but what's this? Oh, no, that's a dangerous one. Staying out of there, we're going this way. Also, going down is dangerous, but when you go down, instantly press space, so you can double jump. I think that's the only good use for the double jumping ability in this uh, game. Um, nothing I would really need right now. But we have 2,000 bits, and uh, I do like grenades. I do like having these. I don't have any Molotovs yet, which I'd like. Or do I have some? Let's see. If, do I have... Please let me have some Molotovs. I have an incendiary grenade. Which is pretty much a Molotov. With a little bit more delay, though. Ant tunnels. I definitely don't have anything to beat those with for now. I think the ant tunnels are probably... The hardest um, challenge that you can run into early because you need explosives on top of explosives to get in. And right now, I don't have anything explosive. Can I get you? There's nothing in here. I thought there was going to be an enemy. Oh, wait. Is it a ghoul? I forgot about ghouls, every pony. And there's zebras. Remember, invisible enemies exist. Oh. Um, I'm going to be daring here. Do I have any points in lock in um, science? I've won. Let's do it. 
I mean, even if we trigger the alarm, no one can get me in here that easily. Oh, a 1% chance. Um, yeah, we're not gonna do that. Oh, come on. I even made it past the alarm thing, and you gotta do me dirty? Um, yeah, so what's what's the deal down here? Ghouls. Um, telekinetic bullet. Hey, buddy. Oh, we're, oh he's, a, he's a jumpy one. He's a jumpy guy. Let's see if you can nail him with a very precise telekinetic bullet. Or a whole bunch of them. Will you hold still? Perfect. Oh, wait. He didn't hold still, but I still got him. Well, I may have let you live if you held still, mister. You just simply need to learn to listen to ponies and don't be a rebel. Well, I am a rebel, but that's my thing, Ant. Okay, this is another extremely dangerous placement for a trap. We need the trap and put it way over there because he can chunk me for like half my health and I do want to make sure that I actually make it through here with my hooves attached to my body, every pony. Alright, and down this way. We can break through there, break through that. Oh, there's a net. Got him. Oh boy. It's, it's Adam. We have to be careful. Adam, 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 Adam. Adam? Yay! We, we definitely want to have Adam with us. Adam is the best thing. If I can't have Adam for the first boss battle, that will make things immensely easy. I still think Adam is the best companion, maybe, together with um, the owl. I like the owl companion as well, but there's also a sword companion, which is um, summoned with magic, and I do think he is the worst one. So we're gonna try to not get him. The Owl is a robot one, though, so you'd have to build and craft him, but he's worth it. He's worth it. He does damage, and he's pretty tough to beat, and I think I found the exit. Uh, let's make sure that we're thorough about this room, though, because you can get good stuff out of here. To the moon! We're not on the moon yet, but I've got, I can send you there, or at least make you want to go there. The moon's made of cheese, so you'll not starve, right? That's a science fact, every pony. Right? I'm horrible at sometimes explaining things, but I suppose sometimes there's not really a lot of fun in making sense. Oh, look at these ponies. They have melee weapons. Analyze your environment. That's the name of this game when you're trying to fight. Oh, that guy has also melee weapons. But he, what, what concerns me is that there's an alarm button in there, and if he pushes that, we are in a lot of trouble. My magic is down to about half. So what I'm going to do is when he turns to the left side, I'm going to drop down and try to get get the button. Go, get the button. Damn it. Didn't manage to get it. Please don't trigger the alarm. Uh, the problem is if I go to the bottom right side and they trigger the alarm, the enemies are going to be pouring in from the, the two entrances at the right side. So I have to do this right now. Got it. We got the alarm. Nice. That's triggered. Perfect. So now we can go in from the right side and just clean up. Perfect. I just hope there's not any other alarm buttons that I didn't see. <gasps> Close that. Close it. Never mind. Telekinetic bullet. Shh. Come on, you fillies. You don't know what you're in for because this cult's going to teach you more lessons than you can handle. Oh. Poor fillies, I'm pretty sure they could use a little training. Um, no luck can stand against me. Um, I'm gonna have to take a take a very long approach with this. Wait till he turns around. That's that's the name of the game, backstabbing, or not really backstabbing, because if you're backstabbing a pony, you would have to stab him from above, but we're stabbing from behind him. That's a mind safe. I think this is yeah, this is where we're gonna use the ele um, electronic pick right here. Um, 90% chance, use the electronic lockpick, so we can get the safe. Let's see, was it worth it? Memory orb, ammo nation, not totally bad, not totally a bad decision, I think. Ammo nation, medicine has been improved again. Uh, oh, oh, I thought it meant that we got the next level, but we do get a memory orb. Medicine's about at level 2? Sheesh, we're doing amazing this time around. And actually, um, scratch that and go for a point in science. Is there any other notable things that I haven't gotten down here? 
Well, there is... Uh, there's another hoister that I haven't gotten. We're gonna get that one now. What's this pony doing? No pony told you you're allowed to go out. You're stuck in here. You're my prisoner. Sheesh, I would be a very vicious slaver pony if I were that kind of pony, but be thankful I'm not. Otherwise, you'd be having problems on top of your problems. Right? You like problems? Well, I, I don't think he does, but he got some. We're gonna get this one. Another 34 caps. I think we've done pretty well. Magic hasn't been suffering too much. But I've also done well at, like, dodging things. Dodging dangers, like with the button and so on. <gasps> Explosives. Remember, we need those in order to beat the ants. In we go. I think we got it. First level of the factory. Um, the main f uh, frame that I'm looking for is on the third level. So we have to make it to the third level. But first, we're going to return to the base. And see what we got, because we did pretty well this time around. Um, do I have... I have... I have magic potions? Sweet! Also, one lesson that I remember from, um... My non-one life playthrough is to never let yourself get healed by him if you have potions. Because potions are exp a little more, um, easy to come by and... Of course, they're not gonna cost you an arm and a leg. But you do need some potions to have on the hoof if you're about to fight a boss. So you need to do some very um, delicate inventory management. We're about to level up as well, actually. Yeah, we're about to hit one. So let's just head back to the factory. Whoa, wait. What about my armor? Is my armor doing all right? I don't... Wait, my armor should be doing perfectly, though. I mean, I haven't taken any damage at all this time, have I? That's right. I didn't take any damage. Seriously, are we gonna have a miracle run and just win? Please. Oh. That's what I get for opening my mouth. That's what I get for opening my mouth. This is a bad situation to be in. Do I have a rune of return? <laughs> oh. Oh no, this is this is what I get. This is Oh, I have a rune of return if it gets salty. But there's two bats in here and they can both knock me off. Let's get this one. Oh, there's another. Oh, get him, get him. I'm about to get some damage. Ooh, he was about to, he was about to make me bleed. Don't think I want that. There's a health box down there, but there's also some mines down there, and I'm not having any. Whew. All right. We've survived the first um, unusual occurrence, because this room, as you can see and look at the bottom, there's a trap, there's some mines, and there's slimes and... Radioactive barrels and a turret too. Oh gosh, another another horrible room, huh? Are we gonna actually have to use a rune of return? I think we're gonna. I think I'm going to. Yep, this is this is a bad setup as it can be. The other room was gonna be even worse, so I'm I'm not having any part of that. Uh, I just wish I didn't have to waste make waste my magic for that single bat. Oh wait, I'm at 2,000? Can I get something amazing for 2,000 maybe? Not really. I'm looking for the leather armor every pony. Leather is going to be like the one thing that makes sure we do well. So we're going to pick it from here and just hit level 2. And hope that we get a better setup. Because that was extremely tough to go through. Mm, a little better. Not, not amazing, but something we can work with. Oh, you... He almost poisoned me. 50% and 30% chance. Can we get both of these? There was nothing. Uh, fine, I'm gonna open this one with um with the crowbar. Eh, eh. I hope there's diamonds or something. <laughs> Thanks, game. Wish thinking is being filled this episode. Sheesh, me and the game are becoming friends at some point, aren't we? Alright, we gotta be careful where we fall here. Um, I'm gonna head through here, through this door. See what we can make. A 15% chance. Mm, let's see what there is on the right side. Maybe we get we get a good room over here. That's a pretty decent room. It's um, not a very treasury room, but it's also extremely safe. Like, you, you are not 
likely to get killed. You get only killed if you go to the center where there is like traps and everything. But if you can stay clear of that, you're actually in a pretty good spot. Let's just put this down. Open it. Oh wow, 15% chances. We we need some some lock picking. I I can't wait to get the level up here. And there's not a way down here. Fine. So what I say is we ignore the box for now and come back because the level up is like right around the corner. So what do we get? There's a bat. What you looking at? I'm looking at this bat. And he's staring at me and I don't like it. I don't like being stared at. 75% chance. Get that one. Yeah, we're about to hit the level up. I think, yeah, the next um, horseshoe is actually going to cover me. Level up has been received. Status, skills. What are we going to make of this? Um, I say one point in medicine. Wait. Screw medicine. Um, lock picking. Um, let's just go for two points in lock picking. One point in survival. And I dare say that I have to go and give myself some magic. At least right now. Give ourselves the magic four. We should be able to get most of, uh, through most of the locks at this point. And we're going to have to pick one. And I choose... Strongest kick. That will save us some bobby pins. Alright, we're instantly heading back the way we came and getting that, getting that chest. And now turned into a manageable 50% chance. I say that while blasting through... All of my lock picks, and it was empty. And it was empty. Nice. Thanks, game. Just when I thought I was gonna become friends with the game, huh? You doing me that? All right, game. I see how it is. Um, there's more stuff in here that we're gonna ne gonna need. A knife, aerosol. I think that's like for a flamethrower thing, right? There's 300 in here, and we're gonna have to get past this mare with a knife. Oh, really? A single knife is all you got? Come on, Philly. Can't you do better? I think you should be able to. 50% chance in mind. Oh, oh, sweet Celestia. Uh, oh, I'm gonna regret this. I'm gonna regret this so much. Can we get it? Oh, it's hard as well. It's hard as well. Never mind then. It's hard as well. I'm, I'm, I'm not even gonna bother with it. 50% chance we should be able to get in here. Please. Nope. Do we get this at least? What? Ooh, that was worth it though. That's that's like um, 400 bits getting that disc. I really want that save. I'm pretty sure if I like um, got rid of the mine, I would be able to open it because we just got like um, two points into lock picking. But I just don't think we have this kind of luck right now. But it, can can I? I need bobby pins. That's what what I really need right now. Let's get this, and ooh, rubies. Sheesh, we're getting a lot of bits today, oh boy. Let's be careful about what I levitate down here. Just need the explosives, everything else is fine. And we're heading down. Uh-oh, 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 I hope I can make it out of this place. Oh no, there's four, four damage, not the end of the world. A laser rifle? Can that be good? I think it may be. 15% chance and 5%. Do we get through 5% chances? Let's try that. Oh. Luna rape you. Oh my god. I don't. Th I'm pretty sure Luna wouldn't mind that though. Well, we get the access terminal. So that means all doors are open right now. Perfect. I can use that because it can get in here, right? And I think this one? No, it was the other one. There's um, a gateway in here that has has a, a fridge, and the fridge can have sparkle colas, like right now. And sparkle colas is the best thing you could have if you're a magic user, like me. And there's a way down too, perfect. But we gotta be careful about going down. We gotta be very, very delicate about moving downwards. All right, this doesn't seem too horrible. Didn't want that. And it's robots. That was actually good that it exploded though, because now we know it's robots. I didn't think those were gonna be here. 
Another save, and I'm gonna try to get it. Let's go. Whoa, no, 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 no. Let's get you. Initializing search procedure, huh? Well, keep searching. I'm pretty sure you're gonna find a magic blasting horse at some point, but if you find him, make sure to run the other way because he can be dangerous and blow your face off. Breaking in and infiltrating memory orb status skills. Um, this time we're definitely gonna fill up medicine too. That will increase our maximum health by a little bit. Alright, so there is a robot. I just wonder if I'm strong enough to plow through him yet. Let's carefully see what we get in here. Oh, didn't hope you didn't see that. Oh, there's a horse you have to get in there. Hey, buddy. 30. We do decent damage to him. I like it. Two cabinets? Oh, no, 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 no. Really? You're not invited to this. Canned beans. I think that increases your max health. We definitely need... Anything that increases your max health when we're fighting the boss. Okay, there's nothing over here. Oh, there's another one of you guys. Telekinetic bullet that. Got him! And explosives. Perfect. So where's the exit? We should be close to the bottom here. Oh, more magic! And experience as well. One thing we haven't found in a while, though, is Adam. I want to find Adam again. I need him for the boss. Alright, what's this? Raiders. Look at all these lousy raiders. I bet you they haven't cleaned their faces in, like, ages. Just dirty, dirty ponies. Let's do, let's do like this. Carefully charge. Wait, well, you're not even going to be able to hit anything in here. Oh wait, I just realized there's an alarm button. Make make a run for the left side. Make a run for the left side now. Oh boy, we're gonna stay in here. We're gonna stay in here. Alright. Ooh, that could have gotten a lot worse than it did, but that means now that there are so many ponies in here, and we gotta be careful. Um, we're gonna get this one now. Raider's saddest, alright? Well, I'm gonna be sad when you're dead. So sad, so scared, and so deadly. Telekinetic bullet. Yeah. Got it. Get dunked on. Woo! She went flying across the entire screen. I can't imagine that being pleasant. Ouch! Come on, I can do a lot more than just a little bit of ouch, buddy. Once I have the better spells, you're in trouble. Wait. If they can get close to me, I can just do this. Yeah. Come on here, buddy. Sheesh. Well, he turned into a smoothie. Don't you want to have a smoothie? No? I think they mind the smoothie. Missed me. <laughs> uh, let's just go down here and ruin him. I hope there is no... Oh. Well, I think he likes snow. At least I like snow. I mean, every pony. I think I've just um, figured out how snow is made. Every pony, didn't I? That would be a really dark secret if snow is actually crushed ponies. Oh boy. Well, there is your dark thought for the day. There's a book. I haven't sold any of the gems yet. I'm gonna have so many bits at the end of this. Oh, we're gonna actually do that. The mazes. I think easy pickings, if I remember. What's the hint? An infravision potion? Really? I thought there was gonna be like some amazing hint at how to beat this. I mean, I don't care about like beating things cleanly this time around. I'm... I just wanna win. That That's all that a one life challenge is. It's about surviving and winning. So you gotta go this way, then make it this way, and I think up for here. Oh wait, yep. Yeah. Oh, you go here, and then you climb. Um, I think it's this way. Yeah. My memory does not totally, totally tell me bad things. Um, is there anything up here? Oh, there's a chest. A submachine gun. That's totally pointless. 90%. I got you. I could buy some pins. Very nice. 
One of you, and one of you, and you too. Healing equipment, even more amazing. I like where this is going, every pony. I like where this run has been headed this time around. Let's get this guy. Um, down we go. Oh no, it's this room again. I'm I'm avoiding this room whenever I can, and you'll you'll understand why if you like ever um, imagine a room which has like six different segments and they can all be filled with instant death. You you know why I want to avoid it. Is this any better? That's a lot better. Yeah. Map information map. One, two, three, four, five. We're five rooms down. The exit's not in sight, but this is this is a good room, I think. Go this way. Nice. Uh, what's this green thing? That's just some old bio gel. Bio gel this. Oh wait, look at this pony. I didn't even realize you were here. Well, he brought me a flare gun. Thanks, Mister. I'm surprised he didn't shoot me. He could have got me for a for insane amounts of damage. A burden, I think, does like five damage per second. And if you're at low health because you're playing at a harder difficulty, that can get you into trouble. There's nothing here. Um, I think there is a safe over here. Yeah, we're gonna get see if we can get the safe this time around. The last time I couldn't because it was it was mined. Um, do we have... Yeah, we got a crowbar, so let's crowbar it through. Alarm. Hard, oh boy. Um, considering where the entrance points are to this, I think I would survive an alarm. Magic bullets. Oh boy, I'm, I'm gambling a lot this time. I'm gambling, I know. I know I'm gambling! Please... Oh boy, close that. It's ghouls. But he's the only ghoul? Um, what is... It's a 90% chance. I can get through there. I can definitely get through here. Um, open it. Open it now. Got it! Bye! Hi! <laughs> I'm out of here. Alright. Missed me. I didn't think that was gonna work. So, we have to go down further. Is the e exit over there? We get it? <gasps> the exit's here, but there are enemies on top of enemies down here. Oh, wait. With all the mole rats, are we going to be able to fill the mole rat quest this time around? Oh, I remember. I can use the ice shards to get all these. Freeze! Well, I just gave him a lot of bad mental images before he died because I turned his parents into mush. Into ice-cold white mush. Oh boy. Well... Let's just make sure that we... Ooh, we gotta get past these guys as well. Hey, boys. Got both of these. I will repair my um, strengthened overall. That's awesome. And we're about 32 minutes in. We're approaching the end of the episode already. But before we do that, I want to see if I have enough to make um, make that quest be completed with the, um, the mole rats. Because if we do... We will have so many bits, it won't even be fun anymore. How many do we have? Mole rat. Oh, we're more than halfway there, though. We're more than halfway there. Anything else that we can complete right now? Um, nothing from you. Oak Star, what? Do you have some armor, maybe? Because I have bits for bits. On top of bits. And... We get, um, the leather armor is here. Um, fire resistance 25%. It is actually very helpful against fire, and it's going to be what we use against, um, the, the raider's boss. So, do we have 5,000 bits? Um, we'll see about that. Sell. I haven't sold anything all day. 
I'm definitely not gonna do the library quest. 900 bits, 900 pre-war bits. Okay, I think shift. It was shift. That way you can sell all the stuff that you don't need. That puts us at six six thousand six hundred bits. Sheesh. That's gonna give us one heck of a start. Oh my gosh, every pony, we're on fire down here. So in that case, I'm just going for the leather armor right now. I'm going for it right now. Leather armor is going to make sure that when the time comes and we fight the boss, we're ready. And it's going to help us against robots a little bit. Um, let's see, what does our previous one do? I want to at least see like the, the, the numbers. That is armor 4, magic protection 3. So this is armor 5 and magic protection 5. I think that's something we could work with. So let's do it. That puts us... Uh, still gives us 2,000 bits almost, which is still pretty insane. Um, of course, I want to put this on. And there we go, everypony. So I think we did some pretty solid work today. I mean, we got almost 7,000 bits from both of our um, tours through the factory. Right? <laughs> Alright, everypony. But I suppose with that, I thank all you lovely ponies so much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. And remember, everypony... Survival is a freeze, everypony. <laughs> oh, sorry.